Good day everyone, this is Gaia here. It's a really nice day outside, so today I'm actually about to go out and check out a brand new spot I found on Google Maps. It looks very promising, it's like a it looks like a bridge, but it definitely looks promising, so I hope to catch something there today, so let's go there. Well everyone, we're out here um, at the supposed map place on the map. It looks a bit I don't know. So far, I mean, I did see one promising sign of life. I did see a blue crab just running around on this side. It's all leafy over here. I'm going to check out the other side to see what's over there. It's a nice day right now. It's not so hot. It's, it's very perfect. I mean, I don't think I, I might be in doubt here, but I'm going to try anyways. You never know. Right here I got me a, um, a nine and a half uh, inch largemouth. I mean, since they're secluded out here, they probably don't know what lures are. In fact, they don't know what they are. And I guess you should never judge a place by how it looks. Well, let's keep going. And then after this, uh, if there are a few fish here. We're going to try the other side and see if there's anything over there. This is the first uh, 12 inch we got. He's the first one to actually go give a nice fight out here. Look how fat he is. Put up quite a fight. And I just started seeing movement over there. Seems this spot has may, uh, may have never been fished before. I'm surprised I've passed this area and I've never seen this area here. Well, I'll let him go. Alright, so the fish I just caught right now that you saw me pull out is a crappie. Here it is, look at him. Man, he looks nice. He's nice and fat too. I've been actually wanting to taste one of these. Originally I had intent of getting a bass, but no. Maybe I'll just spare the bass and take me this crappie. 
course I know he has to be 10 inches so I'm gonna check him right now all right um, I just confirmed his um, his, his length he is at least 13 inches so he's legal I'm taking this fish home with me today better get the string ready all right so there's our fish um, on the stringer now maybe my some might say I shouldn't take a lot of fish from here I'm not gonna take a lot of fish maybe just two fish I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna place a limit even though the limit in Texas for crappie is 25 all right let's continue Oh crap, my camera fell. Damn it with the wind. Let's see if we can put it over here. I might have to bring my bicycle over. I might have to bring my bike. I think I have a theory that this could probably be the one uh, what do you call body of water that, try, that goes by the golf course should actually be very surprising because this is well yeah I guess this is Moses it could make this part of Moses Bayou well um, I'm gonna go check out the other side I'm gonna leave Mr. Crappy right there um, he's on the stringer my camera is getting close to dying, so let's see what's on the other side before it dies. Alright, um, this is on the other side. But as we can see, there's actually quite a lot of trees out here. Of course, I am going to try. I'm going to see if I can get anything. Well, let's do this. It's only been one cast and I already got this little guy here. Right on this little, right here on this filthy water, it hasn't, even, it hasn't even been less than a second and he went and hit straight at the little, uh, the, at the lure here. I'm probably going to try here first and then I'm going to move up. Well, uh, let's, let me go get my bicycle so I can record it.
Alright folks, so I'm going to have to wrap up here. My camera is dying. I would love to continue filming, but, well, it just wouldn't last this long. I hope to eventually get better gear so I could make better videos of better quality. So this camera did cost 30 It's not so bad. Well, thanks for watching and hope to see you next time. Peace.